Good morning guys, Mitch here. Welcome to the week. So it's a bit of a sad day on my side of the fence. I've got uh, to slowly say goodbye to my Tarmac SL7, which you guys have probably seen for a little while here. This is the comp. And uh, this is gonna get packed up with a few different accessories, an extra cassette, some new grips, and find itself a new home. So uh, I know that we're not outside riding because of the weather, so instead I'm gonna go on out, get a bike box from the bike shop, and uh, pack this thing up and uh, take it up to the airport here. So that's kind of what my vlog is gonna be about here and saying goodbye to the old tarmac while, uh, you know, one, one bike goes away. You can kind of see the other one is just chilling right next door to it anyway. So it's bittersweet. Anyway, guys, let's run over to the bike shop, get a bike box. All right, as you can see, got a nice big old bike box in the back of the van right now. Thanks to the bike shop for that. I don't know if you can see them in the background, but that's a pretty sweet, pretty sweet looking shop. All right, well, let's get this thing home and uh, say, say our last goodbyes to the old Tarmac SL7 Cobb. All right, so we're back home and we've got the box in front of us, a nice big Trek box and a couple things that we're gonna do here for this buyer. Uh, this is going overseas. So I'm gonna throw a couple things in here that I have laying around. I don't normally do this, but because the bike, uh, oh, the bike means a lot to me. So I just wanna make sure that everything gets there safe and, uh, and reliably. So a couple things, I got these DT Swiss wheel bags laying around so i'm going to use those and wrap up the wheel set here with them and uh, throw those in i bet you those are a hundred bucks um i am going to put on a brand new cassette as well because i had a sram red on there and i sold this as a rival and i don't know what happened to my rival cassette so i'm going to put on a 12 speed force which is an upgrade for him brand new and I don't know, oh, the chain looks pretty good. Probably doesn't need another chain, but just a general quick cleaning. I'll take this apart. Uh, what else do I have here to throw in? I found the HG cassette body that comes with, uh, for the zip wheels. So I'll put that in there. Charger, all the S works, little, or sorry, all the tarmac little bits and bobs. I found the original receipt as well, that's in there. Uh, short story, I'm getting hosed selling this, uh, but that's all good. And then some new grip tape because I don't think when you buy a bike you should ever have to uh, deal with someone else's hand grips and stuff. So that's going to be a bit of a surprise to the buyer just uh, as a welcome to the new bike and uh, you know make it your own and how you want to do it. Um, okay, I'm going to take this all apart. I might time lapse this real quick and uh, get this in a box. So, let's get started. All right, bike, you've been great. I will see you later. Have fun on your trip down to California. And safe rides moving forward. Ooh. All right, I'm gonna finish packing this guys up and then uh, yeah, we'll, we'll talk after. All right, so we're all packed up as we can see here. Man, truck makes some really nice boxes, honestly. A better box for a better planet. There you go. So pretty, pretty stoked on getting that one done. And that's kind of it. C'est la vie, uh, tarmac. And uh, I guess this one's gonna just have to spend more time with me. Such a shame. All right, guys, that's it for now. Uh, hopefully you enjoyed the pack up. I, uh, otherwise, it's not really a big deal to me. Uh, leave a comment below, like, subscribe, all that stuff. And uh, until Thursday, we'll catch you later. Cheers, guys.